taking a COVID-19 test completely blind. Minimal makeup today, queens, because I'm not feeling that great. I'm gonna ring B my eyes now and they're gonna help me through my camera on my phone take this test because there seems to be quite a lot of different bits and bobs for me to get through. Basically, Be My Eyes is an amazing app that connects me as a blind person to sighted volunteers. And there's a specialised help app with the NHS Test and Trace people at the other end. So I'm excited. Call NHS Test and Trace. Hello. Hello there. Hiya. How can I help? Okay, so I might have cut off from the first lovely lady. I think I'm going to ring them back again. <laughs> end call button by accident. Hello, my name's Chloe and I'm a specialist agent from the NHS Test and Trace. Hello Chloe, I've just been disconnected from a lovely other lady as well but I'm Lucy, nice to meet you. I just wondered whether you could help me complete my um, test that I got sent through the post. So the, the lovely lady who I was just on the phone to said that the swab was about that big i've got to yeah. put that in my mouth chloe yeah so you sort of like you hold the end of it and you just sort of stick it in can you just hold up what you've got and then yeah. check you've got everything so i've got a little baggie yeah uh, and then i've got this other thing i'm guessing that's to put back in the post is it yes that so is. I'll, I'll just put that to the side yeah so have you washed your hands yeah before? yeah perfect okay and have you blown your nose all done okay so if you want to take the, the swab and so you should find so the end yeah, the bit that opens, if you just peel that open, make sure you don't um, touch the... That bit. The, that bit, yeah. So just yeah, take the other end, so the... Like the that. Swab end, yeah. And do you put it in your mouth first? Yeah, and just be careful not to touch anything else. Just, if you hold it by the very end, and you just kind of, like, swab over your tonsils in the back of your throat for, like, ten seconds. Okay, cool. Do you think that was about right? Yeah, that should more. be enough. And then put... Now, then put it up your nose. Just okay. Put it about, it says 2.5 centimetres. Pretty much just till you fi feel a little pinch, until you feel the resistance. Okay. okay. And then just sort of rotate it around for 10 to 15 seconds. About there. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. And then <laughs> if you get the little vial with the liquid. Yep. <laughs> and then just open it really carefully. Okay, right, yeah. And then put the swab in, so like the swab side down. So if I put this right to the screen. Yeah, back that... a bit. There? Other side. To, like towards, there we go. There we go there Is it in? Yeah. Oh, cool. And then oh. you can snap it where the little ridge was. Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. That there came we off. go, yeah. And then screw the lid on. Got it. Put, take the... The baggie. So I'll put this yeah. one oh, yeah. in here. Yep. And then that in, I'm guessing, as well? Yes. Yeah, pop that in. Cool. And, and then pop the whole thing inside the um, other bag, uh, the biohazard bag. Lovely. Yeah, and then you can seal that up. Perfect. Nice, that was easy. Yep, and then, and then yeah, you can just put it all inside the box if you make up the box. So, just, I'm guessing these two, yeah. Yeah, this comes and then up. there's some little bits kind of like there that fold in oh it's yeah it is quite tactile but it's like a bit faffy isn't it there should be somewhere a little sticker that's like a security steel that uh, seal yes that's it oh cool so what does that do so that's you're just gonna stick that over once you put the box all together you're just gonna stick it over just to like keep the box shut secure it oh okay that just goes on does it like yeah that side that does open yeah just right in the middle thank you so much no worries <laughs> do you know how you're gonna send it back uh, yeah, there's a priority post box. I'll navigate to it. See you soon. <laughs> Bye. 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 That box was so hard to do and I had to get some help from Ollie to do it, which was not ideal because I wanted to do it independently. But if I was to do it again, I'd probably just use some sellotape. I'm just going to use the sticker, make sure the box is like that. Off it goes to the post box. <laughs>